spring of 2000, there was about 15 of us that gathered together in my backyard in a duplex in Old Inglewood. And we were having a Bible study, and as we were going through the book of Acts, we were asking the question, would it be possible for God to do the same thing in us that we saw Him do as we were going through the Bible study? And at that moment, God planted a vision within our hearts to think about planting a church. And we knew that over 90% of the people in Denver do not yet bow the knee to Jesus. We also knew that the best method for reaching new people for Christ was the vigorous planting of churches. So as we prayed and really discerned, we felt God place a burden upon our hearts to plant a church. On April 15, 2001, Resurrection Sunday, Wellspring Inglewood was planted. From the very inception, we had the conviction and the desire to not just to plant a church, but to plant a church that plants churches that plants churches, and to see a movement of multiplication saturating this community with the gospel. And through our research, we concluded that the best way to do so was by creating a network. A church planting network is a powerful expression of churches coming together from around the city, utilizing the gifts that God has given them in a comprehensive way. Because we know that not any one church has all of the gifts, but as we come together, we are a powerful expression of what the body of Christ is meant to be and to do in the city. In 2015, Wellspring Littleton was planted under the leadership of Tim Suits. One thing you'll notice when you visit Wellspring Littleton is a community that is all in. They meet in the gymnasium of a middle school, and whether it's getting there early to set up chairs or being all in with the gospel, speaking prophetically into the culture. We recognize that Littleton is very different than Inglewood. It has unique needs that can only be met by people that are within that community. In 2018, we launched out the next church, Rizo Church, under the leadership of Brent Christian. They have a vision for reaching the last, the least, and the lost. They're doing everything that they can to see the kingdom of God come in the Ruby Hill neighborhood. One of the ways that they do that is not only having table in the middle of their service as they share in the communion, but also express fellowship and love for each other as they share at the table after the service as they eat together. Again, identifying the unique needs within that community and meeting those needs with the loving touch of Jesus Christ. And as we've seen this network grow, the leaders are coming together. We have a shared vision, a shared passion, a kindred spirit, a deep trust for one another, and a desire to see God's kingdom come and His will be done. In the next five years, the Wellspring Network has three objectives. Number one, we want to plant five churches strategically placed around the Denver metro area. Number two, we want to see each church that we plant grow up to be healthy, sustaining, and also have within its DNA the ability to reproduce itself in the expression of planting more churches. Number three, we want to not only plant churches that plant churches, but this leads to a movement of multiplication and planting another network someplace else in the United States. The reason why we do this is because Jesus has said, go, go make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Jesus did not say, go to Jerusalem, Judea, Samaria, and the outer ends of the world, only if you have enough money in your budget. He said, go making disciples, planting churches, and doing the work of the kingdom. We believe that if we do so, we will see the kingdom of God come. We will see his will being done, his rule, his reign, his authority being released upon this great city that he loves. We will see lives transformed, prodigal sons and daughters come home, people filled with purpose for the, the goodness and the glory of the gospel. We'll see that. And again, we will see the answer, the prayer that God has given us. May his kingdom come, his will be done in Denver as it is in heaven. Lord Jesus, may it be so.